And now, the benefits of chicory root. Yee-hoo! Chicory root has been in use since the time of the ancient Egyptians for various health purposes. Chicory root comes from the common chicory plant, which actually goes by a lot of different names. Though you might know it best as corn flour, which I actually covered in a separate video. And just to make things even more confusing, endive or radicchio is also sometimes known as chicory, but it's not the same thing. Seriously, why don't they just pick a name already? Luckily, when it comes to its health benefits, there's really only one name you need to remember when it comes to chicory root, and that is inulin. Inulin is a powerful prebiotic fiber that can help with a variety of things, including digestive health. And because fresh chicory root is made up of 68% inulin, this makes it one of the best prebiotics on the market. Multiple studies have shown how inulin is excellent at regulating your bowel movements, so it's no surprise that one of its biggest benefits is to help relieve constipation. As inulin helps to promote healthy bacteria in the stomach, it also helps with other gastrointestinal symptoms by removing toxins from the digestive tract, optimizing nutrient absorption, and soothing an upset stomach. Oh, Addy! I need you, Addy! Help me! What on earth are you going on about? Adiponectin is a protein found in chicory root extract that can help regulate blood glucose levels, and this can help delay or prevent the early onset of diabetes. It's also good for fatty acid breakdown. All right! Now it's also important to note that high performance inulin, which is a special refined type of inulin, has studies that show how it can help improve blood sugar levels even better than regular inulin. Oh. Oh. Preliminary studies show that bioactive extracts of chicory root can help fight arthritis. Chicory root is not only a good anti-inflammatory, but it also helps enhance blood flow and the function of red blood cells, all of which is great when it comes to arthritis problems. One study of 18 participants over the age of 50 with osteoarthritis of the hip or knee were treated with chicory for one month. Of the 18, at least 13 patients showed a 20% improvement in response to pain and stiffness. And while we may need some bigger studies to help confirm these initial findings, the initial results look very promising. Inulin's ability to help you feel fuller, process carbohydrates better, and make your stomach process even more efficient could aid some people in their weight loss journey. There are a few small studies that have shown inulin to have a positive effect on weight loss, but beyond that, Actually, there is no beyond that. There really isn't that much research backing up chicory root for weight loss. For now! Have you taken the time to like this video and subscribe yet? And if you hit that snazzy bell notification, you'll get notified about all my future herby videos! Herb. Chicory root extracts act as an active ingredient, restructuring the skin barrier and preventing skin dryness. These extracts can effectively maintain homeostasis and prevent unwanted skin alterations. Okay, so... Meaning it helps slow the skin aging process. That's good. One less thing. Studies have shown that chicory root extract can protect the liver from free radical stress, blocking cell and oxidative damage. Just don't take too much or it can cause liver damage as well. Yep, that's the double-edged sword of herbs. You can't overdo it. One study on liver health showed chicory root to be particularly effective when taken along with celery leaves. Celery. Why did it have to be celery? Some research has shown how chicory root could be used as a means to alleviate kidney damage caused by high uric acid levels. Though research is fairly limited at the moment and it isn't yet advised as a sole means of kidney support. Speaking of limited research, here's a condition that has lots of anecdotal evidence about chicory root's benefits, but little scientific backing. Some people claim that chicory root's antifungal properties are supposed to help with forms of candida or yeast infections in various parts of the body, and also provide fewer side effects than the alternative treatments or medications. Caffeine can be a big stressor on your body. So, switching to chicken root coffee is thought to be beneficial for your candida as well. I did manage to find one study that showed how chicory root does have strong antifungal properties and that it can be a great alternative to nystatin, a common antifungal medication. So hopefully there's some more research on the way too. One study found that consuming chicory coffee for one week 
led to significant improvements in red blood cell deformability, which helps immensely with the body's ability to respond to inflammation. Chicory root's anti-inflammatory abilities are thought to be particularly suited for helping with thyroid health in conditions like Hashimoto's disease. Though again, more definitive research is still needed. Chicory root is on the FDA's generally recognized as safe list when consumed in normal amounts. However, excessive amounts of chicory root can lead to side effects, like increased menstrual flow and factors that can lead to a miscarriage. So you really need to make sure that you're not using too much or just steering clear if you're pregnant. Chicory root also stimulates bile production, which means it can cause issues with gallstones. According to the Natural Medicine's comprehensive database, while generally well tolerated, some people have experienced flatulence, belching, abdominal pains, intestinal sounds, and bloating. And as it's part of the daisy family, chicory root may cause allergy symptoms if you have allergies to ragweeds, marigolds, dandelions, or chrysanthemums. While chicory root coffee still does have many of the properties we've been talking about, they're not as potent because much of the inulin in chicory root is caramelized during the roasting process and converted into fructose or fruit sugar. Now this isn't so much the case for chicory root tea as the inulin remains in it. But again, it isn't necessarily as strong because if you're not ingesting all of the chicory root, you're not necessarily getting all of the inulin. Hmm, it's tricky, isn't it? But while the benefits aren't necessarily as strong as regular chicory root, chicory root coffee is still vastly superior to regular coffee in its overall benefits. Have you used chicory root before? Or perhaps you drink chicory root coffee or tea? Please let me know in the comments down below. If you want to continue learning about the health benefits of herbs, then you should check out the benefits of dandelion next. Or maybe you should shift on over to the mythology of mint next. Please, be kind, take care of each other, and go. Enjoy the power of chicory root. Yeah, chicory root.